my lovelies and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. So today it's a new month which means that it's time for me to share with you guys all of the squishmallows that I collected in the month of July. But as always to start things off we'll go ahead and we'll look over my hunting footage from the month. So we started off at an EB Games and my sister was actually helping me to show off all of the squishmallows that we found because there was honestly so many in this like weird vertical stand that it's really hard to pull them out and also film them at the same time. Oh, this this massive dachshund. Man, I really wish that I had have gotten a massive dachshund, but at the same time, especially from EB Games, they're just way too expensive. And there's that little T-Rex and then the manta ray again, because I just thought she was so cute with those little spots on the back and another random Snorlax and Oliviana. You know, I really think I'm actually honestly low-key obsessed with the aliens. But anyway, we went to a Kmart where there was so many of that... 12 inch squad left with all of the like little bits of food in their hands and such and then heaps oh yeah there's another one there the chinchilla uh oh yes there's also this little doggo and this like sharky and stuff but yeah just basically all of the squishmallows that are kind of left that really not many people i guess wanted i know that sounds like really mean but just yeah like look there's literally so so many and you know they're actually really cute so I mean, you know, it is what it is. Like that puffer, pu pu blah, 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 puffer fish. Wow, words. I like, I've seen so many of them left and it just seems like nobody really wants them. But here are some of the bum bums that I saw at this particular Kmart. There was actually quite a variety. There was even a blueberry muffin, I think. I must have already shown that and I, oh no, there it is. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, and there are the, the little sushi. Honestly, they're so cute. And that little peace sign and then here's some other ones that were just kind of scattered around the store not too too many and then this is one of the main targets that I generally tend to go to there's just kind of like scatterings left I was actually surprised that there were like some of the seven inch cams like the cam in the little blue visor like honest to god so surprised that there was so many of them left still but like that massive chameleon and the squirrel i just feel like people don't really want the massive 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 squishmallows very often so maybe they shouldn't bring out as many but then yeah just lots of these little like seven inch squads and then like a whole bunch of hug me's and stackables plus that random elsa up on that shelf there yeah so many hug me's left over i was actually surprised by those because they're so stinking cute but here are the stackables that were more closer towards the counter and some more big fellas and then a whole bunch of those smaller squishmallows right near the counters being very careful to try to not get anybody's faces in my video footage and then this zing obviously had just been restocked with all of these 12 inch, I think the 12 inch, like the sweetheart squad little cuties like Oliviana, the manta ray or stingray, and then this little purple doggo. Uh, and then, oh yeah, the pink doggo as well, actually. And like the rainbow squad, uh, like that big, uh, whatchamacallit, the, the grasshopper that I still have not gotten. I was so silly to not get it, but anyways. And then these random like Togepies. I'm honestly surprised by how many Togepies and Snorlaxes are left out and about in the wild. And then here is that toy world that I'm constantly at with all of these clips. And actually later on in the footage, you'll see majority of these clips were gone. Uh, but yeah, I just have so much fun swirling these little things around. It's just so satisfying. But anyway, uh, after that, we move on to the big wall of squish. Lots of the pride rainbow squishmallows left. And then again, so many togepies and snorlaxes. Some of the smaller sized hug me's and then the mystery squad scented watching my bobbies, the little five inch ones. They're so cute, honestly. And then this is kids stuff where they've actually recently been restocked. They've put them back onto their little red shelves and yeah, pretty much same old stuff that they generally tend to have. Lots of, uh, they still have so many of the koalas and the kangaroos, which I actually, funnily enough, went and uh, picked one of each up for my little brother, but they also had some more bum bums in stock, which I was very surprised to see. So this is a big W, as you can see. Lots of just random squish that are just kind of all thrown in. All of There's like probably four to five separate waves of squads just kind of thrown into their bins. Just kind of stuff that I guess they can't really move. 
and oh that whale <laughs> that little bit of footage so funny when I was editing that and uh this is uh, a Woolworths that is actually I go here like pretty much all the time but these exact five squishmallows that you're seeing on the screen right now they're still there even like a month later like nobody wants these little guys I feel so bad for them personally I have a minka already so I'm not gonna get myself a second one then this is at another Kmart so many of just the 12 inches like I guess they're just a little bit too big for most people that bird is cute though on that random Buzz Lightyear to Star Command oh and then I saw these like those pens like I should have gotten them I'm so silly for not getting them and this was I think the first time I was seeing those pads in person these things I swear I knew these things here in this like semicircle thing definitely new very intrigued by them and this looks new as well and then again so many of those I think they're actually 16 inch squish that I just they're just too big honestly they're beautiful but just so big you know that little bird is actually pretty cute honestly and then here we have some more sweetheart squad uh, and some other little random bits and bobs at EB games and then this was the first time that I saw this Hello Kitty squish in person I was so excited and I believe that uh, at this particular shopping center yeah so I went to the big W as well and I saw the hello oh my gosh what's her name my melody and then just a whole bunch of these other guys that we've seen a thousand times in the Harry Potter squad some more of the smaller hug me's and some little random guys over here and then I saw these queen bees for the first time I thought that was very interesting and it's just I don't know it just it's so sweet that it says adopt me I just I thought that was really super duper cute and then a random Coles where there was literally these three Squishmallows and nothing else. I don't even know why I got footage from here, but there you go. This was the first time that I saw the five inch Daxons. This was at another Coles. Uh, I don't remember which day, but as you can see, I, I had to walk out with both of them. I pretty much had no choice but to walk out with them. And then this Big W really didn't have too much. I was just kind of showing everything that was just kind of thrown around the place. But they did have the Queen Bees as well. So we've already been to this Big W in this particular video. But this is just, yeah, like as I said, they had Queen Bees. And pretty much everything else is exactly the same. There's not really too much less in comparison to what was there the other day back to that target that I'm always at so as you saw it would have been like a week prior these shelves were a little bit more stocked Cora she's so cute but yeah like really it's very sparse it's very sparse indeed and that poor Chogabi on the floor oh my goodness you bet your bottom dollar that I picked him up <laughs> I just love Chogabi he's so gosh darn cute but yeah, like so many of the puffer fish and the salamander, that little green dragon and the little seal, I think it is. I don't know. Like, I just, I feel so bad for all of these squish that are left over. Uh, yeah, but still some, so many cams in visors as well. Like, I honestly thought that them ones would have been sold out from everywhere considering cam is like the OG. But yeah, still so many of those stackables and the little seven inches at the counter. Back to that zing that was restocked earlier in the video and I'm actually seeing the Disney ones for the very first time and these little seven or eight inch uh, plaid Hello Kitty squad which I thought was so stinking cute but yeah I'm not uh, really interested in getting any of those Disney Squishmallows personally but here is that toy world again where you could see that that little spinny thing was pretty empty in comparison to previously but still pretty much all the same poor little squishies there now this Kmart had a fresh box of this particular squad the Junie squad but I obviously didn't pick any of these up because I do already have a Junie clip and an Axel clip and just a whole bunch of random stuff here and there. Really not too much to gawk at. Chinchilla was hiding in there and then that little purple mushroom. And then these bins towards the front of the store are always so stocked to the brim with that particular 12 inch squad. That Togepi bag at EB Games was everything. <laughs> Can you tell that I like Togepi? Uh, this was at a Coles and we have this little Monty Doggo. 
And then this little like June bug, I don't know what it is. Its name's Duna. I don't know why I call I call it June bug every time I see it. It's so cute. And then this was actually the second time that I was seeing the little five inch Dachshund. Believe it or not, I didn't actually buy this one. I only bought the first two. But yeah, so that was those little cuties. And then at kids stuff again there was actually even more of the bum bums on the shelf like i saw a little strawberry milk over there and then actually i was surprised to see that there was a little less of these squishmallows on their shelves so this was just a quick little visit this time cute little koala and i saw this little loch ness monster and that silly little purple koala that nobody wants this Woolworths was honestly so stocked it was ridiculously stocked uh, but all of their little squish fills were like the exact same little pack. I was like, really? Really? But regardless, we had this little uh, Lola the unicorn, the little possum, the armadillo. We had Minka in the back there, the goldfish. What else was there? I swear there was a different one. I don't know. The armadillo again. Oh, yeah, the warthog, which, you know... One of these days, I'm going to have to get that warthog because it's so cute. At this Coles, oh my goodness, that like ice cream cookie sandwich, so cute. This place was a mess. Like I honestly should have neatened it up before I left, but I believe I was in a little bit of a hurry. So I just kind of got footage of each of the different little squishies that were there. And Claudia again, and also, wait, oh yeah, no, I actually did. I picked up one of these ice cream sandwiches because I hadn't seen it before so I kind of felt like I had no choice you know and I almost did pick up one of those little yellow sea slug things but I decided against it some more Claudia some more warthog maybe I'll go back to this Woolworths and get that warthog if it's still there honestly because every time I see it I just think it's cuter and cuter and this little Simon the Sloth it was the first time that I'd ever seen a Simon the Sloth that wasn't a huge hug me that was so exciting another Coles had more Dachshunds and Lee the frog in the five inch so you betcha had to pick this little guy up so super duper cute the little Monty dog again a Dachshund again the the June bug and the cookie the what would you call it an ice cream sandwich that's the only thing that I can think that it would be potentially called and that unicorn cat like yes it's sort of cute but also it's just not my vibe it's just not and oh my goodness well too much talking uh oh at this came out it was weird because I hadn't seen Shep in a while and also there was that octopus that I hadn't seen in a while so I thought that was very interesting and the pink Bigfoot also yes I picked those those little plushies up don't even worry about it <laughs> yeah there wasn't like that much at this particular place just a whole bunch of random little cuties and then I did I think after this footage I turned around and I saw some I thought they were drink bottles, but just give it a second. I think after this little guy, we'll be seeing it. They're like, oh yeah, that's right. Like, uh, stationary sets. Yeah, stationary sets. But I literally thought that they were drink bottles. And then, yeah, again, that same squad. This is the last place on the list of uh, places that we did hunting footage in. <laughs> oh my gosh, wow. I'm like, you know what? My brain's just all over the place. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then little... Luann. Wow, that was literally so much talking. I'm like, bleh. <laughs> but it's seven o'clock at night, so a coffee is out of the question. But all right, so I hope that you guys enjoyed the voiceover segment of the video, the hunting segment. It's always so much fun to kind of look back at all of the places that I went to over the month and all of the squishmallows that I saw. And now without further ado, I am so excited to show you guys every single Squishmallow that I actually got. You might remember from a few videos ago, I got this a bag and what I've done is I've just put the Squishmallows in here that I bought while I was out in the wild. And then in my box down there, I've got everything that came in the mail. So first of all, you bet your bottom dollar guys, I had to pick up the little Simon Sloth, the little five inch, he's so stinking cute. Oh my goodness, do you know what I've just realized? I didn't even know this, but his tag is ripped. That is no bueno. I don't like that at all. I'm going to have to somehow mend that. I can't believe I never noticed until now. That's okay. That is future me. Wait, that's a problem for future me. Yeah, that's what I meant. <laughs> but he is so cute, you guys, and his little fluffy tummy. I just can't handle the cuteness. And as I was saying, I had to get a Lee, the little toe. 
dude. He's really cute in the 12 inch, don't get me wrong, but in the 5 inch, he is just so much cuter. There's no like information or like bio or anything like that in his tag, but I just adore his little spots on the back and he's just so silly. He's so silly looking and I love him so much. And then again, as I was saying, I did pick up one of the ice cream sandwiches. I'm not even going to try to pronounce this little cutie's name, but yeah, no, no uh, buyer either. I just think this guy's so cute. And also I was silly because this one had some dirt on its face, so I did have to clean that up, but it's okay. I still think he's so stinking cute and totally deserves a place in my home, in my collection of Squishmallows. Ooh, here are my two Daxons that I got. So the reason why I got two was because this one had the little teal antennas, which I just thought were the sweetest thing in the entire world. No bio in his little tag. But yeah, super cute with the little teal antlers and then antlers? Oh my goodness. Uh, try antennas. And then this one had a purple one and a pink one or other way around this one's the purple one and then this one was pink i just could not choose between the two of them so i just i had to i had literally no choice i had to get the both of them oh i'm obsessed i love them and then the last one from out in the wild was kachina so this is one of those Squishmallows where the longer I looked at it, the more I saw it out in the wild, the more I just fell in love with it. So I had to buy this one. So super cute though, honestly. No information, no bio in the tag, but there's the little uh, watchamabob. I just think this little kiwi fruit is the sweetest little thing. And I'm honestly so glad that I did end up going back and picking her up. And then there's this box. Don't question it. <laughs> so these first two that I'm going to show you, I got from eBay. So I finally got my Pyla. This one is the seven inch Pyla. And it was actually in a deal with another one, but there's the squad in the tag, which I think is really cute. From this particular squad, I think I definitely would like the sunny with the little crown. And even that little purple fawn is so stinking cute. But yeah, so I did get him for a pretty decent deal because the other squish that came with him was this little guy, which I believe his name is Denton, if I'm not mistaken. He does not have a tag, but I do believe that he is a five inch. He is a chameleon, and I actually have the clip version of him, but the the clip was like cut off and it didn't have a little hang tag or anything like that. But I do have a smaller version of him just here, so now they can be little buddies. They're so cute. But yeah, so another one to tick off my ISO list. I really do wish that I had have gotten Pilar brand new, but his hang tag is still attached, so that is just as good as brand new in my eyes. And then I got a Brenda, a brand new Brenda with the flower crown. This one is a 7 inch and I think she's so stinking cute. Her little antennas are so funny. I love the Squishmallows with the flower crowns. They're just too, too cute. There is all of them, the 7 inch squad at least. I would love the little kitty with the flower crown as well. I believe that one's name is Tally, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, look at that shine on her belly from my light. That's so funny. I'm not really a fan of how that stuff feels, but I mean, I'm not sitting there playing with her tummy anyway. Yeah, I just, I'm obsessed. I really do love Brenda so, so much. And with Brenda, I also got Ren. Like what? So Ren is an eight inch. And she's so stinking cute. Honestly, I love the little fluffy antennas. The silver in the wings is so sweet. The pink belly, she's just so beautiful. So this is the squad that Ren is from. And honestly, I'd love the blue cat and that black cat, I believe it's actually maybe like a panther. I can't remember what that one's name is. I feel like it has an X in it or a Z or something like that. But yeah, like I'm honestly so stinking glad that I got another butterfly to add to the collection. So now I have 
Brenda in multiple forms. I have Estefania and now Ren. Oh, she's so cute though. So my two butterflies here, I actually got them both from Collectible Madness. Oh, and I'm just remembering that I got a third Squishmallow in this package as well. It was the little Denton clip with a tag. So this is that same one that I showed you before. This little guy here, but it actually has the tag the tag sorry what am I saying the the clip part still attached so yeah like as I said absolutely identical but it doesn't have any of the tags cut off or anything like that so I was just really excited I think it was on sale as well which was why I decided to go ahead and chuck it into my cart along with the butterflies there's his little tag I don't know if it's really gonna focus very well but then here is the squad that Denton came in. So there's Monica the Axolotl, Bowie the Hedgehog, there's a cute little uh, Foxy, Denton of course. I think that Bigfoot is maybe Caprian. And then, oh, I can never remember what that stripy rainbow zebra's name is. But yeah, so that is his little squad. I honestly have come to adore just this just this chameleon, specifically Denton. I think he is so stinking cute. And another clip to add to my clip collection. But yeah, as I was saying before, these three, the two butterflies and Denton, all came from collectible madness. And also it's funny because I totally could have put another Squishmallow into my cart and gotten it for 50% off because they had like some big sale. But there was just none there was none others that I wanted. So that's okay. I didn't mind anyways. I was happy with my purchase. Okay, so this particular cam has had his little tag unattached because I was actually cuddling with this one in particular. This one is Cam in the blue visor. I do have his tag. It's up on my little board over there. I'll show some footage of what I'm talking about. This was actually the very first Squishmallow that I got in the month of July and it was in a part of a package. So I'm actually a brand rep for a company called Once Upon a Design. I'll pop a link down below if you're interested along with my discount code. But I had a whole bunch of wax melts coming in from that particular company and the owner saw this out in the shops and purchased this for me and left me a really sweet little note basically along the lines of uh, <laughs> in loving memory of Mr. Toby, my little, my little baby that, uh, my 12 year old cat that I had to say goodbye to in May. And when I saw the message and the squishmallow and everything, I just burst into tears. But, uh, yeah, so I, this one has already been very well loved. And now that I've put it in a video, I can go ahead and put it back into the bed. But I just wanted to include it in the video because I just thought it was the sweetest thing in the literal entire universe. And I'm so, so happy that I have another cam to add to my collection. And you guys, speaking of cam, I need to make space. I don't think you're ready for this. Dun, 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 dun. I don't even know if he's going to fit in the frame. <laughs> I got a ginormous winking cam, which is a rare. As you can see, he's got that little silver tag and it does say rare up there. I have a cat scratching at my door. Oh my goodness. This is the culprit. This is Tofu. <laughs> tofu, say hi. Say hello. Say put me down. I don't want to be held. I love you. It's so funny. Oh, you can see pretty much the whole entire lot of him here. I just don't know if you can really hear me very well. Oh my god, I've just noticed it's got a little blue speck on the back. This is like really the first time I've taken it out of the box since it arrived. Can you see that little blue speck? I don't know what that is, but that makes me sad. Look at his little tail. I say little, it's actually huge. Like look at how long that tail is. I said to myself, no more 16 inches. But you guys, it was a rare and it was for Oh, whoa, I just nearly knocked everything over. It was $45 Australian, which honestly is only $10 more than what I would have paid for all of my other 16 inch babies. 
And it's worth it because he's a rare. He's also actually got some info in his little bio tag, which I was surprised about. Just editing, and I realized that I'm a dinkity donkity and forgot to mention where I got this winking cam from. So this one in particular, I got from, or actually I, I pre-ordered from Popping Collectibles. I will put all of the links of all the websites and everything like that that I'm mentioning in this video down in the description box if you are interested at all. But yeah. So, uh, what's that, like, at least two cams to add to my collection for this month? Not to mention all of the pre-orders that I've got in. I have Halloween Squish pre-ordered, uh, as well as another cam of a different type, not a winking one. But uh, definitely, definitely have fun and exciting Squishmallows to come in the coming months. So do be sure to stay tuned. Now Tofu wants to go back out. <laughs> I think that's my cue to end off the video. The cats really want to come in, but they don't like when the door's closed. So I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. I believe the whole segment consisted of about 13 Squishmallows. And like I said, that doesn't even include all of the pre-orders that I've got coming. So I'm just, I'm so pumped. I'm so super excited. I'm going to have to find out a proper way to like store and display all of my little cuties but you know that's that's another problem for future me i'm just obsessed with this guy like i can fully sleep on him he's so big and soft and squishy so if you guys are looking forward to more squishmallow content don't be afraid to go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already as well as clicking the little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified every single time that i do upload a brand new video and of course you guys if you enjoyed today's video in particular and you would like to show myself and or the channel some support you can do so by either clicking on the like button and or by letting me know in the comments down below what you'd like to see on my channel next Thank you all so very, very much for watching today. And as always, you guys, until next time, bye-bye.